Good morning. We are out here on a beautiful morning in the Isle of Capri, Marco Island area. This is Tarpon Bay that we're gonna kayak across and we're gonna make our way to the Marco Island Bridge. I'm gonna use a knocker rig like so and hopefully fish the bottom of that bridge structure for some mangrove sheep's head, um, maybe some goliath grouper, snow redfish, really whatever bites down there. So yeah, let's see what happens. So we're just getting on scene here. It's high, high peak high tide right now. Let's see what the current's working like. The goal here is to fish on the bottom. That's where the predatory and the big fish are that we're looking for. We're using two ounces. I'm hoping we can hold with that. So we'll see. If not, we'll go bigger. I think we're holding just fine. All right, we got our first fish of the day. Doesn't feel too good. Little mangrove, I bet. Yep, little mangrove snapper. Toss him back in. Get a quick measure just for uh, just to see how big he is. Why are we in centimeters? It's a good question. There we go. Eight incher. All right, let's get back in there. Yep. Got one. Oh, that's a better mangrove, actually. That's a better one. Look at that. I'm gonna have teeth on those guys. Come on, give it up. Measure him. Oh yeah, 11 and a half inch here. Got our makeshift cooler bag. Put him on ice. Don't worry, we're not far. Look at that. Got one. I think I found a little hole there. Let's get back in. So this is a really simple rig that we got here. Got your line going to a swivel. Swivel, you've got your leader. Then you attach a weight. I'm using a two ounce sinker and attach it right to your hook. It's really simple. You wanna be as close to or near the bottom as you can. Right here. And let's see if we can pick another one off. All right, another bite. Got him. Oh, he snagged. Wrapped himself around here. Got him out. Oh, he came off though. There's another little mangrove. Look at that. All right, we just dropped down a bit. Let's see how quick we can get a bite. Yep, I'm getting bit. Oh, took our bait that quick. That quick. 
Well, let's try it again. I'll try hooking the tail. I mean, as far as best place to hook them, I've tried the head, the tail. They're really good at stealing the bait. So just try and switch it up and see what works. Instantaneous. That's something. We're doing it again. We're gonna get one of these. These mangroves are very good bait stealers. And you just gotta find out where they are, where you're fishing. But on the Marco Bridge, there are so many, like all these areas look fishy. They look good. So you just gotta find out which one they're at. Got my bait smacked again. Yeah, there's definitely a school I'm hanging out. Let's try throwing on this pinfish. I tried it before, it didn't get any bites on it, but maybe here is where they will bite it. Got another one. Tiny mangrove, I would guess. Very tiny. Is that easy to catch mangroves here on Marco? This guy is still alive. Look at that. Let's see if we can drop straight down and catch another one. Got one. Wow, these are some tiny, tiny mangroves. Jesus, look at that dark color on it too. gotta wade through the smaller fish to find the bigger ones. I mean, literally every piling that I cast on, I would say 80% of the pilings have fish on them. So, they're out there. You could come down here and fish from the bridge too. Not up top, but under the bridge. I see people fishing there all the time. Yeah, but literally every piece of structure here at the bridge has a mangrove snapper on it. Some sort of fish that's biting live shrimp. Got another one. It's short though. Yep, nine. 